Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the DM to the F reading for Friday. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels and I'm going to bring in two decks of cards today to connect with your twin. We're going to bring in the beautiful Divine Masculine Secret Thoughts by Angali and we're also going to bring in the Divine Lover Oracle Cards by Bloom and Arrow. So we're going to use this deck to connect with the energy of the masculine and see what they are thinking about and this deck to see what they want to say to you. So thank you angels. What do the masculines want to say? What do the masculines want you to know on this day? Wow. Flying out the deck, amazing. So let me just grab all these cards here. I feel these cards are moving as well on top of the deck. Let me just pop these that way. And then I'm going to shuffle the Divine Lover cards. So what do the masculines want you to know on this day? What are they feeling about the love? What do they want you to know? And this card's also moving on top. So the energy they are in today... Oh, wow, look at this, hold me. I need to feel your arms around me. So the masculines may be feeling a lot of pain today. Pain because they're missing you. They're feeling frustrated because things are not right in their world. You know, they know that until they are with you, they're going to feel that way. They're going to feel like something is missing, something isn't quite right. They're going to have that sense of longing in them for you. They're going to feel a void in their heart and soul. So you're saying, things are not right in my world right now. Things are not working out right for me. And that's because things work much better with you in their life. He said, I'm longing for you today. I'm longing for your embrace today. I need to feel your arms around me today. So please send me your love so I know everything will be okay. So you may be really feeling this sense of urgency today to reach out to them. And if you are, it's because they are feeling this sense of urgency to connect with you. So they want to connect with you, Divine Feminine. They are preparing and planning to reach out to you. And when we feel that longing, it's always reciprocated. So this is kind of the moment where you have a choice. Do you reach out to them or do you hold off and continue allowing things to happen and allowing things to flow so they take the lead in the connection and reach out to you? And I feel most of you watching will know that that's what needs to happen. So don't feel that, you know, that sense of urgency is the universe prompting you to reach out to them because what you're feeling is the way that they are being prompted to reach out to you because things are not right in their world and they are realizing that more and more, you know, when they are knowing that things need to change and they're not doing anything about it, they're going to feel it physically. It's going to cause physical pain. It's going to make them feel bad. They're going to feel headaches. They're going to dizzy. You know, they give me headaches and feeling dizzy and feeling a bit sick. So he said, I'm longing for your embrace today. Please send me your love. So really what he's saying is, I wish you would reach out to me. I wish you would show me how you feel. And again, that doesn't mean you should in the 3D world. It means that's what they want because the masculine sometimes are so used to reach you reaching out to them, divine feminine. It becomes a comfort zone and they need to remember to step out of their comfort zone to be the one to initiate contact and take the lead in the connection. So he's really thinking, I wish you'd reach out to me. I wish you'd send me your love. But he's really saying, send me love in the 5D. You know, his higher self is saying, send me love in the 5D. So I know everything will be okay when I approach you. Then I know you're not going to reject me or you're not going to tell me you're with someone else. Please reassure me that you'll be there when I come, when I call, when I come back, when I show you love. And the block in my throat chakra. So a lot of pain around this as well. So please send me your love so I know everything will be okay. So I'm really connecting with this energy where the right way to send the love today is through the 5D realm and through the feelings and the emotions and the connection, you know, and there's no wrong way, but it's like the masculines are wanting you to reach out to them so that they don't have to be bold and make the first move yet. They know that's exactly what they need to do. And so do you. So if you're feeling that urgency, breathe and trust the journey and kind of hold off because they're about to hold you. They're about to move towards you. He's saying, I know I cannot give you what you need or want right now. So what he's saying is, I'm not coming towards you right now because I want to be able to give you what you want and what you need the right way. And if there's still a karmic situation or there's still some fear or still some stressful things he's dealing with, financial things, other things, he knows he can't do it in this moment. So he's saying, I can't give you what you want right now, 
but your love gives me the strength I need to keep moving forward. So he's saying, I'm, I am moving forward towards you, even if I can't give you exactly what you need or want right now. But trust me that I will in the right time, in divine time. And this is also another reason why, you know, it's not always the right thing to reach out to them as a divine feminine, because they will reach out to you when they can give you what you want, when they are feeling strong enough. And they're already moving forward towards you and you're going to be feeling that. And that's the energy that came in around the lion's gate, the new moon. And that's why you may be seeing things connected with speed like motorbikes or you're seeing all the signs. Because what he really wants to do is kiss and make up. He's thinking, I want to be able to make up with you so we can kiss and make out and make love. I want to make things right. So he knows what he wants to do. And he's saying, you hurt me more than you know. So what he's reminding you is that he hurts too. You know, some things you can do can hurt him too. You know, the way that he feels sometimes like you don't trust him to do it his way. Or sometimes you feel like he's abandoning you or not loving you. And he feels pain by that, you know, because the masculines do love and care about you. And he's saying, you hurt me more than you know. He's saying you were smothering me. So again, you know, we do do this as a divine feminine. You know, we don't do it because that's we're a smothering person. We do it because we love them so much and we want to give them love. And that's when they pull away and need space because they are reminding us that we need to detach and let go and surrender and allow things to flow. He said, I want to be open and honest about my true feelings with you. I want to do that, but I want to do that when I don't feel smothered or when I don't feel that I have to tell you. I want to tell you because I want to, not because you're asking me to. You are the one I've been searching for all my life. And that's what he wants to tell you. I want to be open and honest with you about my feelings. That I do need space sometimes and there's nothing wrong with that. That you're the one I've been searching for all my life and that I've been searching for you online. But right now I really do need to focus on myself so I can give to myself everything I need to be a better person for you and so that you trust yourself and trust your intuition and trust the love but know that whatever's going on between us I can see myself being married to you and I know we've got a future together so the masculine is really saying to you part of me is pulled to you and I want to tell you how I feel but part of me also knows I need to release the things that need to go and all the things I need to heal and be away from so I can marry you and do things the right way instead of pulling back again running again or you know breaking free again I don't want to do that anymore I'm done running and all I really want to do is feel your arms around me because things are not right in my world without you I am longing for your embrace today and I do want your love and I am hoping that you send me a message of some kind to let me know that everything will be okay but you can do that in the 5D Divine Feminine and then you allow the masculine to do what they need to do to prove to themselves and you that they are a warrior of this love. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.